What's up, y'all? This your boy JP Audio Zero Eight, man. Just another day at the shop, and I just want to come to y'all real quick about this cheap ass wire. Uh, what we have right here is some uh, Rafa Five Gate Eight Gauge, and then we have some SSL Eight Gauge High Performance Power Cable, huh? Now let's take a look at these in comparison. Boom. Nice copper. Let me see if I can zoom in on that just a test. Not letting me zoom because I'm doing this with my phone. Oh, I almost had it either way. You see the Rockford and ooh, look at that. Ooh, that's like a pencil lead. Look at these two side by side in comparison. Oh, I wish I had like an autofocus. Look at that. That's horrible. So I stripped back the little bit of this. Look how thin that is. This is speaker wire. This is this looks. I mean, it says that it's eight gauge because of the diameter of the jacket or the insulation around this wire. But this is literally like maybe 12, 14 gauge even. This is stuff that we use for subwoofers. Now, I strip back a couple of some of this uh, Rockford. Now, that's a true eight gauge right there. So let's look at the comparison on these two. There is none. No comparison on this wire. Now, honestly, man, this is just a quick. Don't buy this. That's all I really am trying to tell y'all right now, man. Quick video telling you don't buy this stuff. How much current do you really think you're going to pass through this little piece of wire right here? Going straight from the battery to the amplifier. Not a lot. Get you some true gauge stuff, man, because this right here is going to burn up. It's going to melt. Uh, too much current through this. You'll melt all the plastic. You'll start burning up all kind of components, and then it's going to be a bad day. So uh, get you some good wire, man. Holla at y'all later.